Hi, Troy Stay here with another album review. This week I'm going to be reviewing Taylor Dane's brand new CD, Satisfied. For those of you who remember the 80s, back in 1987, Taylor Dane blasted onto the Billboard charts with her big voice, her big hair which you can see in the background, and her big hit, Tell It To My Heart. She had a string of top 10 singles including Prove Your Love, Love Will Lead You Back, I'll Be Your Shelter, and she released about 3-4 CDs. In the mid-90s, she turned to acting and she appeared on Broadway in Aida. Taylor Dane hasn't released a CD in almost a decade, so a lot of her fans are super excited about this release. Her voice on the disc is absolutely incredible. It hasn't changed in over 15 years, and in my opinion, she can compete with the biggest divas out there, including Whitney Houston, Mariah Carey, Rihanna, Celine Dion. Just sounds incredible. The first track is called Beautiful, the first single, and um, I absolutely love this song. It reminds me of the old Motown sound, R&B, kind of like the early 80s. Really, really excellent track. I hope radio picks it up. It deserves to be a hit. Now, I was really excited about this album because there's a lot of big powerhouse songwriters on here. There's a song called Over My Head written by Billy Steinberg and another one called My Heart Can Change by Greg Alexander and Rick Knowles. I'm a little bit disappointed with these two tracks. Um, I don't think it's quite their best material uh, out there and the songs I actually prefer on the CD are the ones that were co-written by Taylor Dane herself. A track called The Fall and another song called Love Train. Love Chain. Uh, beautiful, beautiful songs. Uh, my favorite two tracks are probably Under the Bridge, uh, big hit by the Red Hot Chili Peppers in the early 90s, and a song called Crash, which you can hear playing in the background. Big buzz on the internet with her fans about this song, and I believe it actually will be her next single. Now, if you're out there looking for kind of the old Taylor Dane sound, the big high energy songs that she did, like Tell It To My Heart, Improve Your Loves, so it might not be the album for you. This album's a little bit more sophisticated, a little bit more subdued, really, really nice album. Would have preferred something big dance from her. Um, if you are looking for some dance tracks, uh, the first single, Beautiful, is actually remixed, so you can find it out there. And um, she also has a little bit of reggae. There's a song in here called She Don't Love You, which has a bit of a reggae sound. And she covers a Rolling Stones song. Not my favorite track on the album called Full to Cry. Uh, also, uh, Taylor recently appeared on the Jimmy Kimmel Show live uh, a few days ago and sang two songs. She sang the track Beautiful and closed off the show with Tell It To My Heart. And she still sounds incredible. Really hope she tours with this CD. Would love to see her. So, um, if you're out there and you're a Taylor Dane fan, uh, let me know what you think of the album. Uh, leave me some comments and please subscribe. That's it for now, and I'll speak to you soon. Uh, ciao!